matter more in the Fox Ditto because, you know, they're not as guaranteed as yeah. in the Chic Ditto. It's like Chic Ditto is like a script. And if you can if you can perform the script better than your opponent, yeah, then you win. Oh, first grab goes to Harriet. Yeah, and they definitely got chain grabs on. Oh yeah, he learned f he learned real quick playing uh, Nika Boy and especially Dab. You yeah. you're gonna chain grab here. All right, I see how you can Oh, this. ooh, that's smart. Except that I got them mixed up. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Harriet's <laughs> Harriet's like, no, we're not we're not messing around. We're winning this tournament. Yeah, she wants to win for sure. She's definitely the favorite, I believe. Yeah, her or your will win. Her right. your have the best chance, but Flo is definitely a sleeper. Sleeper yeah, he, pick. Like doesn't really play as much as the, those they do now. No, but I think it's um it's it's possible for him to probably be PR'd if he tried. Yeah, yeah, I think so for sure. He's pretty good. So he's definitely like a threat. Yeah. Alright, let's see, uh And I think okay, so Harry just, just demonstrated something I think that is going to give her a little bit of edge. She's so good at shield drops. Yeah, I was about to say Flo is like not very good at it. I was, and she's really good at either it. Either he's not very good at it or he doesn't like apply it a lot like she does. Yeah, he's like trying to, but he keeps air dodging. I think he doesn't have notches. I want to say, because he's I've, I've seen him air dodge like three or four times now on the platform. He's the edge guard. Most of like yeah, most of the mm. grabs. Oh, that was crazy. Re grab? No. I was gonna say like flows. Mm. Okay. Flow can wow. get back into this. He just needs a grab. Yeah, and then it should be dead. It depends how he gets it though, because the last grab he got was on the platform, and so he got like nothing out of it. Okay. I was looking for down air, but the first air works. We grab, throw him off again. Have you ever seen the like match in PAL where like they just back through each other like 30 times until one of them like eventually gave up? I uh oh not until they gave up. I definitely saw the Mewtwo King plup where they constantly were back throwing each other. Yeah, this is like in 2009. Like it was like Amsa and somebody until else. Someone gave Amsa, up. I think it was like Amsa over Triforce or something, and like one of them literally just gave up. They're like, I'm done with this. <laughs> I, my play. entertainment level is very yeah. low right now. Right. Ooh, okay. Oh, that sneaky. that was... Uh, Onish keeps talking about it, too. It's uh, PC Chris drop. Yeah, yeah. PC drop. PC yeah. drop, excuse me. Just do it out of a walk. <sighs> okay, so Onish has dropped that twice. He could have potentially had two stocks there. Okay, so Harry dropped the chain grab. No, let him get to the edge. Easy edge guard. Yeah, he does like PC dropping a lot. It's kind of weird. It's not really something you see Sheik do a lot, because you have to do it out of a walk. So that's why it's like pretty good versus Fox. As Fox, is because Fox like has a really high walk speed. But uh, Sheik's just not. <gasps> okay. Ooh. Onish going for some ult for some uh, style. Good weight on the air dodge. Although like I don't necessarily agree. Like he shouldn't be going for style this at this deficit. Ooh, yeah, ooh, well, ooh, that's good. Sometimes you gotta do stuff to like feel yourself, you know. That's true. Like that's very true. You like I'm back in the game. Especially when is yeah when the momentum's not in yeah. your. Or when you have the momentum, I should say. Yeah. Wait. Oh, oh, third. Ooh, nice. Okay. One grab can end this. He's probably gonna Shima stall. Uh oh. He back. tried to do it. Why? Wow. We see Harriet do a lot. Uh oh. I keep saying uh oh when somebody gets a grab, but <laughs> no one's actually executing what I expect them to. Well, Harriet did at first, but then she just kind of dropped a couple. But uh. Yeah, the first grab was good, but yeah. they're definitely dropping them the whole that whole game. Yeah, that first grab like got her the lead, and then she just maintained that lead the whole time and was able to. Win. See, so, so counter picks. Uh, you know, I don't know if there's like a stage out there that In every ditto you kind of yeah. just pick the stage you're most comfortable on, especially best of five since there's no bans. Like in Fox yeah, Ditto, you his. can ban FD if you're not as good at chain grabbing. But other than that, you pretty much just pick whatever you're comfortable. Fish can needle. Wow, Flo lost the needle war pretty bad. He took twenty percent. Harry didn't take any. Wow, okay. Oh, nice. opportunity. Nice up airs. Dang. Shield up. Back throw? Back throw. Oh, yeah. Dude, this Harry, so it's hard. about to be bread and butter. Like, whoa. Okay. Bread and butter, near miss. Nice. Yeah, that. There you go. That's Do you ever see a plup play? He does a reverse fair at that, in that situation where uh, Harriet is doing reverse nair because it has higher knockback. I don't know how proficient she is at the reverse. The 
You said wait, reverse snare. Fair. The does. reverse fair. Pop I'm not sure fair. how uh, proficient she is. Yeah, I don't know either. It's, it seems pretty hard, honestly. Like, it seems harder than like any of Fox's reverse hitboxes. Four. Nice. Yeah. Ooh. I thought he was about to get it first. He tried. He tried to be so sneaky and like steal the ledge from her. Okay. Let's see what, how much damage he gets. Flo had the right idea with the dash attack. He just like did it too early. Cause he covered all like a lot of attack options. Nice. Dude, uh All right, so sorry. Uh, that PC drop is actually yeah, pretty dang effective. Like, very clean PC. Although, drop. to be honest, it could be a. Uh oh, that's dead. Ooh. It could. A lot of it could be that you know we're we in Georgia are not used to seeing that. A lot yeah. of people really aren't used to seeing it at all. So, like, if Harriet adapts to that, like, cause he's going to do it. He, he's proven he's going to do it a roughly like seven out of ten times. Yeah. But I mean, it's not like in the way he's doing it, it's like nothing Harry actually can do. He's just like Harriet's off stage and he just decides to PC drop to go to ledge. Well, that's not necessarily true because he he came out of the PC drop to ledge into an yeah. attack. So as long as she's spacing like correctly off stage as she approaches. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Like but she can avoid a lot of the uh, kind of cheesier things that he can do with it. Yeah, I think that was the first time he hit her or something though. True. Right. So it's not her fault for getting hit by it. Good down smash. So I love the spacing war between the Sheik dinners. It's like a bunch of tilts and like they like alternate between like forward down and then like they'll do an aerial. It's so funny to me. That's it. Hmm. I think a reverse snare there would have actually well, she's dead anyway, but yeah. How does Sheik deal with four air on shield or four toll on shield? Cause you can't wave dash out of shield grab it, can you? Uh, I don't think her wave dash is long enough for that. Yeah. Um, it's Fox just wave dash. I shots. mean, it, I guess it depends. Like, I think they're probably. Again, I'm not a data expert. That's the problem. But yeah. they're. I think they might be likely frames. Uh, I would say you would probably wave dash out of shield forward and then forward tilt them. Okay. That would likely work. Or jab. Jab to something. I could be totally wrong and Flo's gonna tell me about it later. Yeah, I know Flo's, you Flo's he's gonna message me later and be yeah. like, You're the worst Sheik main in history. <laughs> just, just quit. Yeah. I know you hate phones, but I have to reply to this real quick. Sorry. Oh, it's it fine. is all good. We are here on Dreamland. I feel like this stage uh, kind of suits Flo a little more because he, uh, like when he has space, he's been doing a good job of like working with it. And Harriet's uh, been kind of hugging the platforms. And on this stage, like you don't really get a lot of uh, mileage out of like shield drop aerials in the platforms. Versus like Battlefield and Yoshi's were both like really small stages. And like a shield drop back aerial cover like almost half the stage. Yeah, I'm not seeing her do too many uh, uh, shield drop options though. Yeah, she's mostly forward air and like. I don't think it plays into her style of uh, Sheik Dittos. I've always known Harriet to be like good at this matchup particularly. Yeah, uh, I think she's pretty good at it. It was like, I, I think the moment I knew was it was back in uh, uh, one of the first NACLs oh. where she beat Ari. The uh, A R I, not A U R I. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know if I, have, I, would, I, don't, I don't think I'm surprised by that ever. <laughs> uh, I would at the time I would have been, and I definitely was. Uh, okay. But good pressure there by Flo to get the shield poke. Um. Why'd you just grab in that direction? Honestly, nice. though, like the the last two games started out this way, you know, like solid and even, yeah. and Harriet's kind of like over time taking it, so. It's gonna be uh, ooh, really up to Flo to like yeah, I think change like, the tempo to the his favor. The biggest difference is like her execution's way better. Like she's Harry, uh, Flo's dropped like four or five chain grabs. I don't think Harry dropped like any if one. And that and like she's gotten pretty much every edge guard. She got clipped the last time, but other than that, she's just like been playing really solid. She gets an opening and she gets like 70 damage or a kill every time. Uh oh, I think he saved her. Nice. Get back here. Yeah. She she has like a really good room to work here and get extra credit. Yeah, for sure. Like 56. Yeah, now she can get like another 40 damage. Honestly, honestly this could be a stock. Like, yeah. yeah, he knew not to DI back. I think or she DI missed, forward, excuse me. Yeah, I think she missed the turnaround also. Yeah. Thank 
she's really good at like the <laughs> whole edge guard scenario. Like she doesn't get mixed up by the double jump or like a B at all. Honestly though, and it's like as a sheik in this situation, it's like super scary. Yeah. Because like when you're high up, pretty much anything can send you off stage. And then it's this rinse and repeat back air thing that you were about to see. Yeah. That's gonna be that stock. Alright. Yeah, Hopefully this is... Flo can take this one without taking any damage. <laughs> oh, as, as, as you say that, he takes like a couple from an up B. Yeah, he's but, like, Yeah, this is a very uphill battle for Flo right now. Yeah. Um, I don't think he convert off that. You know, well, I think I don't think he can convert, convert off that, but I think he could have... <sighs> this is, goes back to assuming Flo is practiced, but he could have... Reverse fared and got the kill. Yeah, I think. yeah, you could have done that. I think reverse narrowed a kill at 144, too. Oh, that's. Ooh, curtains. Okay. All right. That is a, a clean JV3 from Three Harriet. and a box of donuts. Yeah, so as Harriet 